my first video for 2018 so uh, happy new year everybody i really hope you're really ready for this year because i'm freaking opera super ready that's for sure if you haven't yet please subscribe to my channel i do fashion advice i give fashion advice twice a week and i love it it's my passion it's 2018 and this is gonna be even better so be ready for it and my other announcement is that my second magazine is officially out ready just for you and i love the end result please let me know what you think about it i'm gonna put everything in the description box below as well as my website which is www.eatpreandshop.com everything is gonna be right here in the description box below and somewhere here in the screen the magazine is for winter for january edition and i just decided to actually incorporate more like jackets type of outfits and this is gonna be that it's gonna be mostly that kind of inspiration that i got from that edition as well as the skincare routine for winter because i think it's really really important to really take care of your skin especially during winter well to me it will be like throughout the year i mean all year long but especially in winter like it's so dry you really need to take care of your skin and i actually give you some tips when it comes to my routine and what I do actually to keep my skin hydrated as much as I can and really moisturize as well. So it's great. Love it. Please check it out. You're not gonna regret this and it's free again. So it's even better. I don't know when I'm gonna be able to have like that kind of month description but I really want everybody to actually enjoy it before then. So please take a look enjoy and believe me this is gonna be late this is gonna be a new year i'm ready i'm excited i'm way too excited i think <laughs> i'm really way too excited for today that was my 
first video, like I said, of 2018, that was gonna be a dragon inspiration type of outfit. Can you believe it? It's officially winter. Well, we've been in winter for like as long as I can remember, especially here in Canada. But it's so cold. But I still wanted to do that kind of outfit where it was like kind of light jacket that you can actually incorporate in your outfit and then put a really good big winter jacket, especially a Canadian winter jacket, on top of it. Because to me, it's not doesn't necessarily mean that because it's super cold you don't have to be stylish so everything that i'm gonna show you here well that you saw in the lookbook part of it it's something that you actually can incorporate in your wardrobe in your outfit and then put into a coat on top of it most of the items that you saw on the lookbook part was from my boxing day shopping at zara mostly no wonder <laughs> and uh, a bit of very model as well but this is really great because actually Zara here in Canada I don't know for other countries but they really keep going with the it's really like going on sales and everything you might be lucky because actually trying to get rid of their stock so check it out I'm gonna put everything in the description box below as usual this is not gonna be uh, it's gonna be the same thing right and here is gonna be the part when I'm gonna tell you how I did what I did and why I did the way I did it so Let's get started, shall we? I'm gonna start with the jacket that I showed you in the lookbook part. There were two of them, and it's gonna be the part one because it's gonna be another part like for the second video of the week. But this was like kind of gray jacket in that kind of tone, gray, dark, that kind of tone. The first one that I showed you was this one, which is really nice. I love the pockets, but it is Zara, no wonder. And of course, it's like plaid, which is the trend for this year again. It's really long on me, probably because I'm short, but it's so thick and it's so warm. I am actually really surprised how warm this jacket is, actually. It was $59.99. Actually, I still have the price tag here. It was originally $99.90 Canadian dollars, and I got it at $59.99 Canadian dollars. A really great deal when it comes like to the quality of it. The second jacket was this nice with that kind of details on the bottom. I love it. But it at Zara as well. It's actually longer than the, the first one and it's not plain, it's like plain grey. Love the full suede material in it. Super 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 light. I mean I'm telling you it's super super light. It was originally $69.90 Canadian dollars and down to $39.99 that I actually paid for but I think I paid even like cheaper than that because when I saw my receipt it was I think $25 but I could be wrong but anyways either way price is really good for the style of it it's like super trendy it's super actually really a good idea to really invest in that kind of like jacket with which generally are are coming so much more expensive so to me it's a really nice investment to actually like but some of them especially during sales because the price is so good and the quality is better than the price because it's not the price originally right so yeah the first one was with this really nice dress that i bought at Veromoda a couple of months ago you saw it in my lookbook so i don't need to say a lot to it I love the details here because it's kind of see-through on the top and it's all like flowy on the bottom. So cute and I thought with the plaid jacket it was definitely, definitely a really nice idea to actually combine the both of them. What I did for the shoes is actually to incorporate these really nice fishnet socks from Zara as well. It's so cute, I love them. For that with these boots, definitely defines my style. The whole outfit for me was just me from A to Z. You can wear it during winter, especially here with when it's like super cold, but what you can do is actually to have some kind of tight and then you can wear it on top of it. It's an idea. It was all dark again, but I think I'm really, I, I love dark colors. And again, here was the details. I mean, the pocket puff on the jacket, the really nice details with the fishnet socks, the bag, I mean, everything was really dark, but with some nice details to it. The second outfit that I paired with my gray plaid jacket was 
with this skirt from Forever 21 that actually you saw as well already before in my previous lookbook. What I did was to pair it with this really nice fringy top from H&M. Um, I love the combination of the both of them. I thought again here that the details were really really nice. It was all plain here, all fringy but still plain. You can actually add even more texture at the bottom as well as some details because plain so details and texture are actually to me the best idea that you could have. Pairing it with like a plain jacket add even more like interesting visual appeal to it, right? So always say add details, add just that kind of visual part of it because you need to look at it and be really able to see okay it's all dark there's no much of frames but it's just about having details to your outfit that's it my third outfit with the play jacket again was this stuff from um, Zara as well and I think I got it if I remember because I already removed the price tag it was at dollars something like that <laughs> I'm not a big like message on the top type of person but I think this one was really simple and actually reminds me a bit of maybe wash with care dry with love wear with style <laughs> so that's all not no need to say much to it I put it with this best pants from Vero Moda it's actually a really nice pants I mean the quality of it is just the killing part I tried it on, got it from the back me as well, and I think I got it at 50, 50 or 60% off, so I ended up getting it at, I think, $25, $29 maximum. I love the little details, it's not too much, it's not always like showing, so it's just enough for me to actually put everything, even more thing to it, to actually add that kind of visual part of it. Of course, I had to have my favorite bag, for the year probably which is my studied metallic bag from Zara that you saw many times so I don't think I need to say more to it. <laughs> I love everything about it. I think it was much more like casual than the other outfits. It was like really laid back but with the jacket it actually has that kind of modern sophisticated look without doing too much. So casual chic if I could say. You can be chic but you don't have to be chic every day. If you wear a jean, for example, just wear it with a really nice jacket and believe me, this is gonna be the third layer that's gonna make your outfit stand out so much more. So my last outfit with my gray jacket, my long gray jacket, was with these really nice pants. Um, my top from Zara, again, that I got at, I think, 12 or $9, something like that love the combination i think the white pants combined to the gray jacket a really nice color that actually goes really well with like kind of gray because it's not a harsh color it's really light and it's really like good at flattering light colors and you add the black top in the middle what i did is to just add this really nice bag that had that kind of pop color to it and actually had a lot of like colors that could actually tied everything up in one. The skation, because they are so basic as colors, like my outfit, I got it at Zara at $25.99 if I remember. So uh, yeah, I really love this bag. It's really cute, really small and really good at actually adding a really nice pop of color. Yeah, I love this too, together with my really nice jacket. So. Let me know what you think. Yeah. That's it for today. I hope you really enjoyed it. Like I said, don't forget to subscribe if you like it because it's gonna be much more and it's gonna be even better this year. But check out my digital lookbook, it's amazing. I love it. Check out my website, check out my blog as well that I need to actually like update this week. So I think I've said enough here. I will see you at the end of the week as the second video. So until then, be happy, smile because it's free and it's 2018. So here you go. Smile. Bye.